Y'all owe every 4C girl an apology for this. I'm sorry. Y'all do. Y'all do. It was disrespectful. <laughs> Welcome to La Vida Rosa. I'm your host, Peaky, and today we're going to be talking about Sally's and this mm, very interesting promo of one of their straighteners using a black creator. So if you'd like to see more than just stay tuned, like, comment, and subscribe. Without further ado, let's get into this video. All right, you guys. So I've been seeing this video go viral all over social media, and I watched the first few seconds and I was like, wait, I want to react to this <laughs> on my channel. And let's talk about it together. So let's just go ahead and get into this video. The style that transform water into cold vapor for you to use to straighten or curl your hair, which equals less passes that equals less damage. We're gonna try some my 4C hair. Like let's let's get into it. As mentioned before, my hair is really coarse. I have 4C hair. Guys, do you see that vapor? Oh. Now this is where I stopped because I'm like, no, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Now, she very well could not know this. I'm not trying to come down hard on her, hate on her, nothing, okay? But when you have natural hair, that is a big no-no. We are not putting heat on dry hair. First of all, before you even get ready to straighten your hair, it needs to be blown out. Preferably, I will wash my hair first, blow it out with a blow dryer, and then go behind it with a flat iron or whatever tool you're gonna use. I feel like that's gonna give you the best results. But going straight dry hair and putting a flat iron on it and hearing the snap crackle and pop, that just sent chills up my spine. Like, <laughs> whew, okay. Not to mention, it's supposed to be showing how the tool is not going to damage your hair, but that very sound just feels like it's being damaged before our very eyes. My gosh. That was one stroke. It took only one stroke, but it's, it's still... They got it. Yeah, they got it, they got it, they got it. They got it. I'm gonna go close up so you guys can see the vapor in action. No, not her going back on. You guys no. see that? Isn't that so cool? It's sizzling like bacon. It's not supposed to do that. It's not supposed to do that. <laughs> oh my goodness, and it's not, like, it's not really straightening it. Two strokes in, my hair is straight. My hair usually takes about four to five strokes to even six that's another no-no if you want to keep your color if you want to keep your curl pattern you really don't want to do more than two or three passes you really don't and really doing the 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 rat tail comb and, and chasing it with the flat iron that's going to be your best bet that's going to be the best way you only want to go through two or three times or your curl pattern is going to be fried died and laid to the side like what we looking at right here that does not look healthy that does i i hope it curls back up i really do so for this to basically be already be straight with no prep no twist no blow dry nothing straight from the curls to this and the worst part is it's kind of cringy because you know most black women are looking at this the same way i am they're just like, no, no. I see why this went viral. No, no. Like, we just want to grab your hand and stop you from doing it. No. Oh, my goodness. How did this even get posted? How did this get approved? That is the coolest thing ever. The thing is, <clears throat> when she showed the little steam that's coming from the tool, that's actually very interesting. And I would like to see that used properly on 4c hair because i do think it's possible to straighten 4c hair and have it flowing and be bouncing and behaving i've seen it happen but i feel like it needs to be a professional or someone that really knows what they're doing 
using a tool like that because you have to set yourself up for success, not failure. Dry hair, but even with the straightening, I can still feel my hair moisturized, silky, and smooth. You know what? Let's have fun and just curl it because it's also a curling. It's meant to curl your hair and straighten it. Guys, look at my baby curls. No, I'm having way too much fun with this. Guys, look at my baby curls. And yes, that is technically a curl, I guess. But I doubt that curl even holds. I feel like your hair would revert right back if any sort of like real humidity or moisture hits it. Look at that, look at that. Oh my God. Okay, I'm really here looking crazy trying to give you guys first impression of this tool. But I'm obsessed, like what can I say? I'm obsessed, it's like silk press straight. You better run to your local Sally Beauty Secret. No ma'am, that is not silk press straight. It's not. No, no, it's not. My eyes see what they see. That is not silk press straight. And like I said, 4C hair can be silk press straight. I've seen it. But that's not that. This was just released today. And I was one of the first few that I got to try. This is going to sell out. Like 100%. Go grab. Not with this advertisement. I don't want to be rude or disrespectful to the girl at all. But a part of me is like, did you really not know did you really not? Even if she did, I'm not mad at her for getting a coin. I'm a, I'm a content creator. I understand being a content creator and wanting to make money and wanting to work with a big company like Sally's and wanting to give them a video that they can use, right? But it almost feel like she was playing in their face a little bit. <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie. Because what? I feel like that did not show how great that tool worked, right? I really just don't understand who, who okayed the video? Because I know as a content creator, when I make content and I sign that contract to, you know, collaborate with this specific company, there are specific guidelines. And also there has to be some sort of approval before you post it. But this was actually posted on Sally Beauty page. So there were so many balls dropped. Clearly there is no black people in the room. Is there, is there black people in the room with us at Sally Beauty? How did it get okayed? Who posted it? Who approved it to be posted in the first place? And another thing that crossed my mind is possibly maybe they did this on purpose. Maybe the creator, maybe they got the creator to make some sort of spoof or parody or something so they can go viral for a negative reason because people do that these days. Or maybe they knew that this was not a good you know demonstration and they knew that they were going to get a lot of heat in the comments you can't tell good comments from bad comments in the analytics so people do a lot of i think it's called rage farming when it comes to posting somewhat ridiculous things in order to garner some sort of negative attention and it, it runs up their views and in turn runs up their pockets right so that very well could be it this was supposed to be marketed to black women and black women with 4C hair texture. They already um, get the short end of the stick when it comes to texturism and how loose curls have taken over the natural hair movement. And a lot of products are marketed towards those loose curls and not 4C coils. You know, a lot of those products will dry that sort of hair type out as well as fooling a lot of people with 4C hair into thinking their hair will be able to do what someone with a 3C hair texture will do. And that's just not true. So it just, it almost feels icky in that way that once again, y'all are trying to sell some BS to people with 4C hair when they go through enough trying to find proper information for how to care for their hair for y'all to put something out like this it's almost like a mockery it's almost as if you are trying to clown them and i don't know if that's what y'all try to do on purpose but y'all y'all need to apologize y'all y'all owe every 4c girl an apology for this i'm sorry y'all do y'all do it was disrespectful y'all should have got a creator with 4c hair that knew how to use the product correctly and knew how to demonstrate it correctly on her own hair if this was sincere for her she just doesn't seem like she has much experience with straightening 4c hair but y'all could have found there i'm sure there are so many black hairstylists 
that are content creators, okay? They could have demonstrated on one of their clients. I'm giving Sally a major side eye. I used to go to Sally all the time and I've worked with Sally before in the past, but um, I just have to be honest about that because that just wasn't cool. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this down below in the comments. I would love to hear your opinion and I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Peace. Thank you.